graduation, she moved to San Pedro de Macorís, was connected to a guerrilla group that was opposing the American occupation of the Dominican Republic, and she started providing them free medical care. This is the story of the first woman to graduate from medical school in the Dominican Republic. Meet Andrea Evangelina Rodriguez Peroso. Born in the Dominican Republic and abandoned by both of her parents, she was raised by her paternal grandmother. Andrea went off to a medical school where she studied how to provide care for people. After graduation, she moved to San Pedro de Macorís, was connected to a guerrilla group that was opposing the American occupation of the Dominican Republic, and she started providing them free medical care. She left for Paris to continue her studies, came back at OBGYN, and provided free medical care to sex workers, single mothers, and poor people. This, of course, made the now American-appointed and backed to, uh, dictator Trujillo super upset. He made it his mission to destroy her. Andrea was tortured many times. The last time she was tortured, she was dumped on the side of the road where she died, um, succumbing to her injuries. Andrea made it a point to make sure that people had access to care no matter what. Thank you.